Hey everybody and welcome to the Overly Gaming Project and today we are back in PGA 2K21 career mode and this is episode number five. All right in the last episode we were at the Lighthouse Open. We tied for ninth. We finished six under for the tournament and the winner was George McDormand. 14 under. We did gain a couple points and then this happened. We went to the Lunenburg Championship and we didn't make the cut. We were absolutely awful in the first round and did not make the cut. And uh, the Lunenburg Championship was a very hard course. It was a lot of wind. You know, Johnny Davison struggled to make some putts and lo and behold, he got cut. So with that being said, we lost a few points and that brings us to the Summit Championship. And we have played the first round of the Summit Championship and we are 10 under. We have come back with a vengeance. And Johnny Davidson, you know, after not making the cut there at the Lunenburg Championship, he's been practicing. He had a couple extra days of practice there and he is on fire. His putting is awesome. He played this course in the first round like an absolute pro. 10 under. As we go in to the second round, we have got a nice cushion. And that's where we're going to start today's episode, with a nice cushion. So without further ado, let's get in to this Summit Championship and let's see if we can't wrap it up. All right, as you can see, this is the Cloud Crest Country Club. And it's a beautiful course. It's not that difficult, which is probably why we did okay. I have not changed any of the difficulty settings. They are where they are. I was actually going to try and make it a little bit easier after we didn't make the cut in the Lunenburg uh, championship thing there. Uh, but I decided to keep it the same. Let's just keep it real. Our goal here is to try and make it to the PGA Tour. So we need to finish in the top 25 of the golfers on the Corn Ferry Tour. And I'm pretty sure we're going to be able to do that. So it looks like after this championship, we should be called up to the PGA Tour. All right, and it looks like Johnny Davidson has got a new outfit, and we are ready. Kind of like Tiger. Last round, you got the black pants and the red shirt, and we want to emulate Tiger. And we want to be a Tiger. We like Tigers. Tigers are cool. They have stripes. They're big. They're cats. They can jump on things and kill them. It's, it's all good. So this is the outfit that we are going with for this final round here. And hopefully we can get called up to the PGA Tour. And if this is your first time to the Overly Gaming Project channel, then welcome. If you've been here before, then welcome back. And let's help this channel grow and hit that subscribe button. And hit the bell notification so that you're notified of all the content coming out. At the end of this video, if you like what you've seen, go ahead and hit that like button. And leave a comment down below. Let me know how your golf game's going. Let me know how PGA 2K21's treating you. Let me know if you're still playing the Golf Club 2019. Nothing wrong with that. And let me know in the comments down below, do you play golf in real life like I do? And do you suck as bad as I do? I want to know. I want to hear it. And if you can guess my average score over my last four rounds of golf then I don't know, you're probably not going to win anything, but I will tell you, I'll mention you in the next video, which is a huge, I mean, let me tell you how important that is. I mean, if you can guess the closest to what my average score was over the last four rounds of golf I played, then you're not going to win a prize, but I mean, you'll just feel good about yourself. Okay, so in the comments down below, let me know, what do you think my average score was over my last four rounds of golf? 2K Sports and the Corn Ferry Tour are proud to bring you today's event. We're here at the Summit Championship. Today's coverage is about to begin. Pleased you could join us for this final round action. I'm Luke Elvey, here alongside Rich Beam. And Rich, as this next golfer begins the day, what are you thinking about their chances? Should be a lot of nerves. They got the lead. They've been sleeping on it overnight. That is never an easy thing to do. Almost an uncomfortable situation at times, but they are playing well, so they have that confidence going into the final round. But this is going to be a tough afternoon ahead. I know I can't wait. Let's get back down to the coverage. All right, Johnny Davidson armed on the first hole. It's a par four. All right, we got the wind coming in behind us at eight miles an hour. We are going to pound this ball right down the fairway. Wow, he let the big dog eat on that one. Oh, that's right. 
Wolf, wolf. The big dog is eaten. And that is a huge drive. 340 yards. All right, here we go. We got the wind behind us again. We're using a 7 iron. We're going to club this down, I think. We're going to go with a 9 iron because the wind's behind us. Let's see if this will do it. Choosing the 9 iron here. All right, that's a pretty good shot. Well, this will be good for the momentum. Let's make this birdie putt. Wow, if we can make this birdie putt, we're going to be 11 under. Here we go. Get excited. This could go in. Oh, man, just and a bit outside. The par. Well done. All right, we got a par. And that's pretty cool. And I'm waving to people. Welcome to this hole. That's a par four. And after a par at the last, a chance to perhaps signal some intent. All right, here we go. We got a par four again. Wind's behind us again, six miles an hour. We are, we're gonna use our driver here and we are gonna shoot for the fences and try and hit it over this ravine. See how we do. Can we get over it? Oh, okay, we're in the first cut there. This one is in the first cut and it's sitting up pretty good. So they might have a good chance here. All right, we are gonna use our pitching wedge here we're going to come in just on the edge of the screen here. Let the wind kick it in. Here we go. That's a full That's pitching like wedge stroke. Pitching wedge. All right, a little bit past the hole, which is not bad. All right, we are in a pretty good position here for a birdie putt. Let's try this out. This one's dialed in. Oh, right in the hole. Let's go. The lead continues to grow. This is simply amazing. All right, it is simply amazing. We are now 11 under. Now we got the wind coming kind of back at us. We're going to use our driver. Hopefully we can stay out of this bunker on the right-hand side. Looks like this one's heading safely for the fairway. All right, wind blows it right into the fairway. Now we got a great we're shot. This season. Number two would be very nice here today. All right, we're going to pull out a nine iron here. Hopefully that wind will settle it down. And we are going to use some loft. Here we go. Oh man, what a That's shot. A looking shot into birdie range here at the third. And that is right next to the hole. We got about eight feet. Let's set this up for a birdie putt. This would put us at 12 under. Ooh. Oh man, just a bit outside. And look, oh my God, we went real long there. All right, par putt, this is a pretty tricky one. It's got a chance. Oh man, it's missed it outside again. Way. And we're gonna this tap this in for bogey. So after that hole, this is the current standings. All right, so I'm still course. waving to people. Bogey will do. And there's no movement on the leaderboard after that hole. Let's see what happens here on the fourth. All right, fourth hole. It's a par three. Wind's behind us at seven miles an hour. We're using our seven iron. We are going to put some loft on this. Not too much, though. Here we go. Ooh, well, that's a that's good shot. That's oh, a rolls off the Had green. Couldn't quite get there. And missing it long with that approach, not a good leave. All right, here we go. We got to chip this up here. We're actually going to chip it a little bit to the right to let it run. Big chip. All right, that's not bad. Good recovery. If he makes this, he'll save his par. All right, here's a tough putt here. Big break right to left. Ooh. Oh, man, that's a bad miss. And, whoa, almost fell down. Holy crap. All right, here's a putt for bogey. This is not uh, the way we wanted to start off here. Good looking putt. All right, there's a bogey, and, and that's okay. We'll take to that. Bogeys, unfortunately. Two bogeys in a row, never a good sign. Have to see if they can rebound from that. Well, we can rebound. Coming off a bogey, trying to reclaim some momentum. All right, here we go. We got our three wood. We're going to change it to a driver. That wind's going to knock it down for us. Oh, Here we go. Pummeled into submission. Nice drive. Sitting at nine under. Currently in the lead. All right, we got to carry this water. We got the wind coming left to right, kind of back at us a little bit. We got our three wood, and I'm not sure about this. We might want to lay this up. Here's a par five. We're actually going to try and lay this up a little bit. Right about here. Going with the five wood. 
And there we go. Good layout. Here's a little lob wedge pitch, although the wind's coming right back in our face. I think we might be better off using a splash shot with our gap wedge. Let's try this. Oh my god, look at that. Unbelievable. Now here's a birdie to put us back at 10 under. What a shot that was. Well, that's an early statement right there. That is definitely a confidence builder. All right, I'm waving to people and again. Still in top spot after that hole. Keep it going. Two great shots are required here because this hole is a long par four. All right, we got a long par four. Winds right to left, a little bit behind us. We're going to use our driver and carry this bunker on the right. Not a bad line, this one. Well, that's a pretty good shot there. Time for the second shot here at the sixth. All right, we got a tree in our way here. Wind is left to right. We're going to have to aim over here. We got our pitching wedge with a normal loft. I think that's going to be okay. Let's go ahead and try it. We need this one to bounce right. Okay. Bad approach. Grab the putter from the caddy. You're dancing. Made All right. birdie on the last. Looking for a second in a row here. Trying to get a second birdie in a row, that's right. This is a tough putt. We've got a fast break left to right, right in front of us, and then it evens out. It's up about four feet. I don't know about this. Go on, get in the hole. Oh my god, what a putt. Yeah, and I'm fist pumping. That's right, now I'm waving to people. How you doing? Birdies moving the right direction there, Luke. Par three is always fun. See if you can knock it close. Here we go, it's a par three. And man, that last putt was awesome. We got to build on that momentum. We've got our three wood. Wind's behind us about five miles an hour. We are going to club down to the five wood. We're going to see if we can make this work. Okay, nice shot. And we are on the green. That's tiny. And this putt is for a big two on the scorecard. All right, here is a big putt, 17 feet. It's down about four feet. Don't need to hit it hard. We got a slight left to right break. Let's try and get this in there. Now it's oh, just a bit outside. Yeah, it's just about three feet away. And we save par on this well one. Done. Let's head to the next. All right, it's the eighth hole, par four. Looks like the wind's in our face, seven miles an hour. That's okay. We got our driver in hand. Let's go ahead and knock this out there. Left nothing in the tank on that one. That was pummeled. All right, good drive. Playing from around 160 yards. Pro tip, when it's breezy, swing easy. You're welcome. All right, here we go. We got our seven iron. Wind's coming back at us. I think this is going to be good. Here we go. That's a good strike. And we are on the green. Not a bad shot, that one. There's a long way, but I tell you what, I've seen it happen before, so there's a chance. Well, here we have a tough putt. We got a right to left, pretty strong break in front of us, and then it goes to a right to left. I'm sorry, we got a left to right break that's pretty strong in front of us, and it ends up with a slight right to left in front of the hole. 43 feet. Wow, this is what we're doing. Cross your fingers. Let's go. Oh boy. Now that's a mistake. How that's pretty that wicked. Short? All right, here's a par. And that's all we need here. And, down and there it goes. is. All right, the end of the back nine, the ninth hole. It's a long par five. Winds left to right, seven miles an hour. We're going to aim right for this trap. And hopefully the wind will blow it back over into the fairway. Wow, he let the big dog eat there, didn't he? Oh, wow. That's a great drive. This is the second shot here on the ninth hole. All right, here we go. We got a bunker we got to deal with on the right, a long one, and we got one on the left. Wind is left to right in our face a little bit, seven miles an hour. And we got our three wood in hand. Let's go ahead and lay this up here. Oh, and that's a perfect shot. And here we are with the third shot. Wind is blowing left to right. Going to try and hold it against the wind. All right, here's a tough shot as far as the wind goes. I am going to put a little bit of loft on this, but not like we're going to need it. 
Here we go. And that's an okay nice. shot. Well, Rich, think they can make this one? I really can't say I'm a fan of their chances on this one, Luke, but I tell you what, I've been wrong once before. Yeah, you have been wrong before, jackass. If I make this putt, I might come over and smack you in the face. Mm -hmm. Oh, man. Okay, power. I missed it. This would be a great up and down. All right, we're putting. Okay. Oh my down. god, I missed it again. Holy shit. Just six feet between here and the hole. And All right, now saves down. bogey. Whew. Lovely position for our leader here, Rich. Out in front, but a few holes to go. Well, keep your hands to yourself. But yes, this player is definitely dialed in at the moment. Oh man, taking a look at the leaderboard after the front nine. Jackson Pool. He's coming up behind us pretty quick. He's... Four under for today, which brings him at eight under for the tournament. There's only two shots between him and us. Crap. All right, after the ninth hole, we went to clubhouse. We had our hot dog and our Red Bull. And we are ready for this back nine. We got the wind behind us, strong nine miles an hour. And let's go ahead and blast this one out there. Hell of a drive. And taking aim from around 100 yards here. Straight down wind. Tough to put a lot of spin on it and hold the green. All right, we're going to change our pitching wedge. That wind is going to blow this ball right towards the hole. Oh, boy. Here we go. Chosen the pitching wedge here. All right, we bounce up on the green. There we go. To play there third. All right, we've got a putt here. We're up seven feet. Not really much of of a break here we just got to power this putt up this little hill oh what a putt what a putt for birdie holy moly that was awesome we got to take another look at that off the edge of the green up a hill straight into the cup and I'm fist pumping teeing off here at the 11th this hole is so important at this critical time. Go for it. Lay it back. How much do you trust your swing? Well, we have got wind behind us at 9 miles an hour. And that is going to carry this drive. We don't want to overshoot this green, but we do want to be a little bit aggressive. All right, here we go. Let's see if this works. Now's the time to take chances. Oh my God! And we bounced up on the green Just pretty far. Play there, Rich. Gotta love it. Taking out the big stick and going ahead and walloping it right onto the green. All right, here we go for an eagle putt. 41 feet. The hole is down about 10 feet. We're gonna hit this kind of light. Here we go. Oh, just missed on the outside edge. Wow, what a great putt. And now we're here for birdie. And there it is. Wow, 12 under. I like it. Two in a row. Currently three strokes up after that hole. We find ourselves on a par three here. All right, here we go. Par three, winds at our back, slight left to right, ahead eight miles an hour. And we are just going to grab our five hybrid. We are going to put a bunch of loft on it so it'll slow itself down. Opting for the hybrid, I think. I mean, that's a great strike. Yeah, that looked pretty good the whole way. Well, Rich, from where I'm sitting, this looks makeable. Do you agree? Look, All right, I here say, we go. I'm really not liking their chances here, but you never know. Stranger things have happened. That's right. Stranger things have happened. Thanks for the confidence, jackass. I hope I make this putt. I'll come over and smack you in the face. Whoop! Yeah, I missed it. Of that. Fair effort. This is a par putt. All right, I'll take the par all day long. And this is quality play, still on top of the leaderboard. Let's see what happens here at the 13th. All right, 13th hole, wind's behind us six miles an hour, and we are going to smash this out into the fairway. And that's a great drive. Pretty good shot there. All right, we can make the green in two. 
We've got our five wood, but I think what we're gonna do is we're gonna take our five hybrid and we're just gonna try and roll it up towards the green. Don't wanna take any chances here and screw up this lead. Going with the hybrid. Oh crap. That sucks. From the we're sand, in the sand. Looking to get up and down. Alright, well, I hate this shot. We're gonna give it a shot though. Oh my gosh, what a great recovery. We are up on the green, ready for a birdie. To the cup. And, and there it is. Fighting spirit that keeps a good round going. And that is a nice birdie from the bunker. Way to go. We have a par four on this one. All right, par four, 14th hole. And we are going to smack our driver down here. Let's go. Oh, well struck. This drive's heading for the fairway in my eyes. Second shot here on the 14th hole. All right, here we go. Second shot. Coming into the wind. Wind seven miles an hour in our face. We're still going to use our pitching wedge. Actually, I believe we could use a nine iron. Put some loft on it. And that should be good. Opting for the nine oh, iron. Oh, look at that. And that's not that's far enough. Inside the range. Shit. Outside chance here for the birdie. All right, this is a big putt. Lots of break left to right at the end of this. I don't know. I just want to get this one close. Oh, oh my God, I just missed it. Oh, look at the look of disappointment. All right, there it is for a uh, par. Here we are in front of a par three. All right, here we go with our five hybrid. We're going into the wind, but what the hell? We're going to take our chances. Looks to be going with a hybrid here. All right, we are dancing. Yeah, not a bad effort, that one. Up onto the green and a chance to hold your putt. Slim chance for a birdie, but in all reality, two putt for par would be just fine. Hey, look, slim chance for a birdie. Jackass, how about giving me some, some props here? Again, if I make this putt, I might come slap you in the face. Was a uh, I missed attempt. it. And this one is for his par. All right, there's the par. Let's head to the next. Sweet. Nice to have that cushion heading down the last few holes. And after that performance, they'll stay right where they are in the standings. Three holes remaining, folks. Hang on to your hats. This is going to be a wild and wooly finish. Uh, actually, it's not going to be so wild and wooly because I have a four-shot lead with, like, two holes to go, so uh, just uh, shut your face there, jackass. Mm -mm. A thing of beauty. Second Great shot drive. On the 16th. Alright, second shot. We are going right into the wind. And oh boy, we got our five wood. And we're just going to smack this up there. Opting for the five wood. Oh, and that is a beautiful strike. Look at that. Be nice to wow. see this one go down. Let's see if they make it. It's a tough putt. We got a right to left break here. Tell you what, if we make this and get another birdie and go 14 under, we have taken this corn ferry tour and smacked it in the face. I don't mind the look and this. there it is. Well That's done. another birdie, 14 under. Two holes to go, Luke. I know who I like. Unbelievable. This is great. We might have to change the difficulty a little bit once we get into PGA Tour. All right, we got the wind coming at us. We're going to use our driver. Oh, just absolutely abused the golf ball there with that shot. Second shot here on the 17th. All right, this is a tough shot here. Wind's going left to right. Seven miles an hour. We got our lob wedge. And here we go. Well, that's comfortably on the dance floor. Well played. Wow. Good shot. Just nine feet remaining to the hole. All right. Slight left to right break here. Here we go. Oh, what a shot. Oh, just nice missed one. it on the outside. Par putt coming up here. All right. Here we go. This one for par. And there it is. It's in. Still in the lead now after that hole. 14 under through 17 holes. And now this player tees off their final hole of the event with the lead. All right, here we go. 
Last hole, the 18th, it's a par 5. Got wind coming at our face, we got our 3 wood. And if we use the driver here, perhaps we can get on this fairway over here. Let's take some chances. Hey! Oh Where did that boy, come from? almost. That's not his style. All right, here we go. We're using our five wood. We're gonna hit it onto the green, taking chances. We don't care. Let's do it. Oh, and look at this. Boop, bouncing up on the green, yeah, well, and it might not be we're on the good. Green, but it's right up near the surface. A hole out from off this green here. You win the tournament. All right, here's our lob wedge, and we're just gonna chip this up here and let it run. This putt for the tournament. All right, this putt to win the tournament. It's a birdie putt. Ooh, nice looking putt. Oh, and that's it. We are fist pumping. We won the tournament. Victory, Rich. If one is good, two is twice as nice, isn't it? Two wins on the season for this player. Awesome stuff. That's right. Awesome stuff. Take another look here. And that is the putt for the win. And we are going to move on to the PGA Tour. I'm sure of it. Well, that'll just about do it. On behalf of Rich Beam, I'm Luke Elvey. Thanks for tuning in. Look forward to your company next time. And taking a look at the leaderboard, we absolutely smashed the competition in this tournament. The Summit Championship, we finished 15 under for the tournament. We were 5 under today, and nobody else even came close. An 8-shot lead for the victory. Corn Ferry Tour, bye-bye. PGA Tour. Here we come. Oh, we unlocked a new item. Looks like a watch. And we got 250 coins. And we reached level 14. Well, there it is. Johnny Davidson promoted to the PGA Tour. It's by finishing in the top 25 of the Corn Ferry Tour points rankings. Johnny Davidson has earned a promotion to the PGA Tour. Quote, I'm thrilled with this result. I can't wait to start playing on the PGA Tour. End quote. Welcome to the PGA Tour. Compete against the best professional golfers in the most challenging events of your career. Do you have what it takes to be number one? Our objectives, qualify for the FedEx Cup playoffs. We have to be in the top 125. And the Tour Championship, we have to be in the top 30. Win the Tour Championship and take home the FedEx Cup. Wow. That would be awesome. All right, we're going to keep everything the same. Normal difficulty, normal conditions, and two rounds per event. And we can always change these if it becomes too hard or too easy. Let's do the first event, and then we'll kind of see where we are difficulty-wise. And uh, we can make some adjustments as needed. As a PGA Tour Pro from now on, you have the opportunity to take on sponsor contracts and unlock exclusive rewards. Since this is your first time, we have arranged your first contract for you. Once this sponsor contract is complete, you'll be free to browse and accept new contracts from a variety of brands. Sweet. Well, cool. Here's a con our contract details. It expires in two events. The difficulty is easy. Per objective, we get 200, uh, I guess, little coin things. We have to score six birdies or better in this event, or in the next two events. We have to finish a round in a PGA Tour event with a score of four under or better and place in the top 10 of any event. Those are our objectives. Whew. All right. Well, taking a look at these sponsors, boy, wouldn't it be nice to be sponsored by someone like Callaway or Ben Hogan or maybe Adidas. We can get some nice shoes. And look at this. I'm on the big board with Tony Finau. We got Matthew Fitzpatrick. Matt Kuchar, Kevin Kistner, Justin Thomas, Jim Furyk. We got all the big names here. Probably Dustin Thomas, Bryson DeChambeau. This is going to be amazing, and I cannot wait. The next event, the Golf Club Open at Katagawa Country Club. That is awesome. It's 18 holes, and man, I'm excited. And this is going to happen in the next episode. We start our career going on the PGA Tour. And man, thanks a lot, guys, for sticking with me. I appreciate the uh, support that this series gets. If you like what you saw, hit that like button. Leave me a comment down below. And don't forget, hit that subscribe button and the notification bell so that you're notified of all the content coming out. And most importantly, thank you for letting me be a part of your day. And I'll see you in the next episode.